Brand new GTA 6 gameplay just got leaked. This is the first time footage came out for GTA 6 since the initial hack and reveal over a year and a half ago. And this time around, the gameplay and footage we're gonna be sharing with you guys is confirmed to be real and it's a lot further along in development. So the game looks a lot closer to what the final and polished version will be. And crazily enough, this all started yesterday over on TikTok where the leak was initially posted, which I know right away puts a lot of people up with speculation at it being fake, but trust me, once we provide the proof and show you guys the clips, it'll make more sense. So with that being said, I will throw up the original leak that went viral over on TikTok and then quickly went over to Twitter and Reddit and all the other communities where leakers uh, talk to each other. And as you guys can see, it's nothing crazy. It's basically just a clip where the person is panning the camera around showcasing a large area of Vice City. And the main reason people thought this was fake is this is the type of clip that could easily be faked using the game engine for other games or using mods but people quickly did some detective work for us here in the community and they actually did some comparisons for some of the old gameplay footage that got leaked and lined it up with some of the new footage from this one and it did seem pretty early on that this was actually a very valid in real leak since a lot of the city skyline and skyscrapers lined up with the older gameplay leaks that we got over a year and a half ago which were 100% guaranteed real, which is a very good guide as to see if this newer gameplay that came out was also valid. Now, here's where it gets absolutely insane, is the person that actually posted this gameplay over on TikTok, uh, the account is known as Azarosi, leaks and rumors came out that the new gameplay leaks are reportedly posted from Aaron Garbert's son. Aaron, if you guys did not know, is the current head of development at Rockstar North. So he is a very high up, lead developer at Rockstar that is probably actively working on GTA 6 and this is actually his son's TikTok account. The account itself posted pictures of the kid and Aaron Garbert which confirmed it was real and yeah this account posting leaks literally was his son which had everyone pretty shocked honestly. I'm guessing there is definitely going to be some legal di disputes and battles and stuff that happened from this. I'm not really sure what his son was thinking but hey shout out to him. He took one for the team and gave us some new insight and new leaks to check out. Now that account also posted another version of this clip where they actually zoomed out showcasing more of the room and the setup and everything and like I said this just furthers the case that the footage was real. If they zoomed out you would see a lot more stuff to make it a lot harder to fake it which just like I said verifies it even further. And we also have proof from someone over on WhatsApp that messaged this guy and was asking him questions about GTA 6 where Aaron did confirm and said about twice the size of Los Santos for the size of the GTA 6 map. All I can say is that the map leak is real and then this guy asked is there other big cities in class and then he goes on to say there will be three major cities and four sub cities within smaller areas surrounding with a large lake around the middle of the map. Now another leaker here a part of the community took all this information and gathered pretty much a pretty basic summary covering everything you guys need to know about this leaked footage and all the information it actually revealed. But they went on and posted Grand Theft Auto 6 map details have been leaked to the public a few days prior to the actual trailer reveal which obviously you guys got to keep in mind that trailer will be dropping in three days from now so a lot of these leaks are going to be kind of obsolete once the trailer comes out but we still don't know exactly how much information that trailer will give us. He went on to say the leaker revealed the footage on TikTok for no particular reason claiming it was a good timing for the most part since the trailer was a few days away anyway. The footage suggests parts of a larger vice city consisting of two times the size of Los Santos current map in GTA 5. And this is actually something that a lot of us knew prior because there was a lot of information and leaks about the map size and map details uh, that came out back a year and a half ago. So this just further solidifies that information as well. They also went on to say he is the friend of the son of Aaron Garber, Rockstar Games head of development alongside Rob Nelson. The leaker claimed the following that there will be three major cities with four sub cities in smaller locations, a large lake in the middle of the map. The footage was also recorded in September of 2023, but he held off for the reasons stated previously. The build version that we are seeing in this leaked footage is build version 636, about 100 versions following the leaks from September 2022. So like I said, this footage and leak is significant because it shows us a lot newer and fresher version of the GTA 6 uh, development cycle. And this one is gonna be a lot closer to what we actually get at the game's launch as compared to that one that was over a hundred updates old. He also shows three 
three new unknown sports cars, and a skate park alongside an aerial view of the city, which you guys saw the different skylines and stuff, which is absolutely awesome. And he completes this summary with saying the information above is confirmed due to the user's deletion of his accounts, videos, and a selfie of himself and Aaron Garber. So again, that is how we know this is all 100% legitimate. Obviously, anyone can go and post some real looking leaked gameplay on TikTok and go viral, but having the proof and actually having pictures with this guy and then also having other leaks and information just further proves that this is 100% legitimate for anyone that's thinking it's fake. So of course, let us know what you guys think down in the comment section below on this video. I am very, very curious your guys' thoughts. What do you think about this new gameplay? Do you think it is looking a lot better than the original leak gameplay we got back in September of 2022? And are you guys excited for the upcoming trailer release on December 5th? I am absolutely hyped to see what they have in store for us for this trailer. I hope it's a long one. I hope it gives us a lot of details. I'm guessing it probably won't, but it still should give us some new information. And uh, I just know that everyone is going to be dropping what they're doing to watch it when it comes out. Also, make sure you guys join our Discord server. A link to it is down in the description. We are going to be giving away a bunch of copies of GTA 6 to members of the community as we hit milestones. We are currently on the journey to 2,000 members. So make sure to go join it. It's a great way to talk to us, connect with us, people a part of the community, make some new friends, and uh, just further discussion about GTA 6 and everything gaming. But that's all we got for you guys today. If you enjoyed, make sure to drop a like, subscribe to the channel if you guys are brand new. Make sure to turn notifications on so you don't miss further videos, and we'll see you guys in the next one. Take it easy, my friends. And Jay Norris is dead, man. Oh yeah, he's dead, is he? Just like there's a country called Finland what? and a pot of gold at the end of the rainbow <laughs> by my crank. Open it, come on! Tommy! Been too long. Thank you.